It's 7.01, and the news is next. But why? When we put together programming for the radio, we often think in terms of each hour, and each hour gets its own clock. The easiest way to think of a clock in that regards is as a pie. We're cutting up that hour into different pieces. So let's look at how it works. Two of the biggest news shows you listen to are Morning Edition and All Things Considered. They originate from National Public Radio in Washington. They provide us with a full program, but we have the resources here locally to create a regional edition, morning edition, and all things considered. We can curate each hour and provide you a mix of both national and regional news that is made with you in mind. This will carve the clock into slices, some big, some small, and each day we move those slices around the pie to make them fit. There is some wiggle room with the slices of the pie, allowing us to bring you a blend of the news each day. But we do also work around something called a hard post. That's a part of the clock that just can't be carved apart or moved around. So why is the news always at 7.01? The first minute of each hour, from zero to 59 seconds, we call that a billboard. During the billboard, we'll give you a preview of what's in store for that hour. The billboard ends at 0 minutes, 59 seconds, and then at 1 minute after, we have the news. You'll then hear a few minutes of news from National Public Radio, then you'll hear a few minutes of local NPR news. The rest of the hour then is made up of multiple segments. Each day when you tune into Minnesota Public Radio, you find a variety of stories and news. Thanks to support from members like you, we are one of the few public radio stations in the nation with the resources to create rich local coverage. You value our coverage, so you keep supporting us. Thank you for making it happen.